cocktail was also on loan from the RAF. It was uh, just about as we planned, with one or two little hiccups. Um, obviously the first time any of us have done anything like that, although we've practiced a lot in the past, uh, the plan worked. A lot of heavy fire? Yes, a great deal. Obviously uh, no one has actually seen it before, but uh, as we crested over the ridge to run into the airfield, there was a complete blanket of uh, exploding AAA shells at a couple of hundred feet and a lot of uh, visually laid AAA actually firing at us on the run-in. How did you feel going into that? Did it give you pause for thought, or were you not able to think when you're moving fast? Well, for about two seconds, it scared me fartless, and then uh, after that, we just had to concentrate on the job in hand. It was, we all knew what we had to do. We knew which routes we were taking, and it was just a question of getting as low as you could, weaving around what flank you could, and uh, putting the weapons on the target. What were you putting down and where? I took three CBUs, and my brief was to run in from the northern end of the airfield across the runway and uh, spread them across the runway into the domestic side, into the aircraft plan. And, uh, could you get any idea whether you, how well you'd succeeded? Um, yes, I think uh, my first bomb probably took out an aircraft which was on the northern side of the airfield, a little light aircraft, and then the remaining two rolled across the airfield into the pan which was uh, actually full of smoke and flames already at this stage. Mm. What did it look like? The airfield itself was just a great... Well, the airport buildings were just a, a very large area of uh, fire and smoke and dust. Uh, you couldn't actually pick out or pick out very little detail in there because there was so much. Could you see people on the ground? No, you couldn't see any people. I think they were all pretty well down foxholes. Uh, but you could see a lot of guns firing. And you've got a, a hole in your tail. Yes, that's right. Did you know about it? I felt it, yes. I didn't know where it had hit. Uh, just as I was dropping the weapons, uh, there was a large thump from behind me. Uh, I knew I'd been hit, and the tail started vibrating. The plane um, was OK for flying, though? Yes, it was flying quite normally, apart from the vibration from the back end. Uh, so I just ran out as quickly and as low as I could, and then pulled up and 